How's it going, y'all? You see, about a month, month and a half ago, <clears throat> did a survival tips of <clears throat> peppers. Well, um, this here is, uh, I told you guys I was going to look into it. Um, I uh, just got done with 37 years of having some kind of pharmaceutical in me for, you know, physical or other things um, straight. So I'm trying to clean my system out. And I talked to a friend of mine, he said, try some Hawaiian chili pepper water. So I looked it up, but basically I made my own hodgepodge out of it. Talked to a few guys that have been using it for years, and uh, they said, yeah, sounds good. So here we go, and I'll give you the results in a couple weeks and let you know. All right, here we go. Take four cups. This is for a quart solution, by the way, one quart solution. Take four cups of warm to hot water, not boiled. Don't boil it. You want four teaspoons of salt. Four teaspoons of apple cider vinegar. The recipe actually calls for rice vinegar, but I want a little bit of apple flavor, so I'm going to put that in there. And then it calls for four quarter slices of fresh ginger. I just couldn't find any fresh ginger around, so I estimated that to be about two teaspoons, roughly, you know. It's mostly for flavor anyway, so I can always add a little bit more later. I'd rather do less than more at this point. So two teaspoons of ginger. And then <clears throat> the recipe calls for four to eight, excuse me, eight to 16 small dried red chili peppers. Well, um, I've been having some peppers stewing for a while, <laughs> about three years in a jar of running and everything. So I pulled out about 16 peppers, small peppers worth, no, excuse me, eight peppers worth. You know, I estimated what it looked like swollen. So this is it, and I chopped it up. I highly say wear gloves, man, because if you get this up on your skin and then touch your eye, nah. Um, the reason I'm doing this too is for purification process, and also with the purification process, this stuff will help you to uptake more protein, which I need at this point. So here we go. See what happens when you put this nice big capsaicin balm in here. Again, this is eight, approximately um, eight small dried chili peppers swollen with water. Make it easier to cut. And again, I'm going to wear gloves wiping all that up. You guys can't smell it or feel it, but <laughs> woo! Here we go. So, anyways, I'm gonna let this steep. I'm gonna stir it a couple times, let it steep overnight, and then um, <clears throat> refrigerate it in the morning, cap it and refrigerate it in the morning. And uh, again, I'll be back to you in a couple weeks. So, yeah, we'll see what the bomb does to my to my system. Yeah, thanks for stopping by. Whoop whoop. Peace.